Hola, namaste. This is Priyanka Vadra from Sutra. What got me started after almost two decades of corporate life. I deal with vision issues, very severe vision issues, both hereditary as well as caused by an injury. It's given me the grounding, the flexibility through the Vinyasa Yoga Flow practice. One breath, one movement. I do it as my passion, as my purpose and amplifying this wellness to others. Welcoming you on the mat for a morning wake up flow to start your day fresh and smiling. We move through a few sun salutations and keeping with the breath flowing through vinyasa. Let's gently close our eyes, palms pressing to our heart center, Anjali Mudra. Slowly start to feel the breath within you and gently release. Start the practice together with the nose. Waking up the body with this fresh breath. Let's start to spread the palms out with this energy to kick start your day. Lotus Padma Mudra and remember to keep this freshness with you throughout the practice. Bring the breath back to your heart center and once again stretching up. Palms come together. Exhale and release. This time let's open the palms up. Out onto your bellies, pressing the belly against the spine, exhaling it out completely and stretch up last time, reach up, exhaling this time, let's extend out forward, walk the hands out forward on your fingertips, breathe, palms off the mat and gently let's start to walk back with the breath, rolling the shoulders, sending the breath back to your spine, keeping the buttocks grounded rise and stretch and let's rotate release the palms onto the other side inhale float the hand over drop it over to the right side stretch the left side of the body lateral stretches and gently come back up exhaling walk over to the opposite side going across above your knee reach 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 and extend the left hand this time, reach over, release the palm back and stretch the right hand up and lift the left palm to meet the right, breathe, extend up, sitting up tall, letting the breath guide you upwards towards the ceiling, towards the sky and exhale, let's bring it back in, gently take a pause, breathe and think about how the day is looking ahead for you, what's got you on the mat today morning and what you want to take off the mat as you move on into your daily life. So let's kneel in front of the mat, palms pressing down, extending the feet out, neutral tabletop, wrist, elbows, shoulders in one straight line, back is flat, belly engaged, core is engaged, Breathe, you can even use a hand to check your back. And as you extend the toes out, check that your knees are under the butt. Breathing in and out here. If you want to, you can close your eyes. As you start to feel the breath within you, turn the eyes of the elbows forward. Pressing all five fingers down firmly and gently start to wake up the body with the breath. As you extend up, smiling and smiling through your shoulders. Tuck in your toes, round the spine, rise up. Take this as slow or fast as you want. As we move through cat-cows, I'd recommend starting slow, 
moving with the breath. Breathe. Inhale, Vikrasana, cow pose. Exhale, cat in your toes, merge the yas to the cat pose. Let's do a couple more together. Reaching up and tucking in. Every time try to lengthen with the spine a little more. Release the head in between your upper arms. Extend the toes out. Let the breath guide you from the tailbone all the way to the neck and the crown of the head. And tuck in once more. Slowly bring your toes together. Let's extend back all the way. And inhale, move forward like a wave. Coming forward. Exhale, release the back. If you have any gap here, maybe you want to shimmy back just a little, extending back out. If you can't go down with the head, maybe make fist and release the head down. Inhale, roll forward one vertebra at a time. And this time let's tuck in the toes and gently start to lift up, lift the butt up. Short down dog, Adho Mukha Svanasana, releasing the heels back wherever you can reach comfortably. Release it down, extend back out. Inhale, moving forward, tuck in the toes, rise, peek in, up and exhale down. Stay with the breath. Hold it here and gently as you exhale, release the knees down, stretch it back out and move forward, last one, stretching the feet out, tops of the toes extending back and then tuck them in, lift, keep the core engaged, straighten the legs, release. If your heels don't reach the mat and it looks like this, totally alright. Just work within yourselves, within your bodies. If you extend front and back, try to keep the weight distributed evenly between the hands and the legs. Slowly look forward. Take it on your feet forward in between your hands, letting yourself hang loose. Maybe you're still feeling very tight this morning and you want to walk your legs right here let your head go a little deeper you can bend the knees as generously as you need to folding forward breathe and slowly let's start to roll up one vertebra at a time from seven from six five four three two one rise up bring the palms together maybe once again you want to open up light the lotus exhale back in padma mudra to anjali mudra back to the heart center so let's repeat this stretching up and you're going to fold forward every time trying to hinge from the hips as you release down and rise up from seven six keep at your own pace, your own breath. Maybe you also want to close your eyes. Stretch up and as you open your eyes, look up at the lotus on top and bring it back to heart center. We'll do it once again. Stretching up, breathe and inch from the hips, flourish, forward, forward. Rise up, maybe a few more counts now. In five, Four longer breaths. Three, two, one. Stretch up. Exhale. Bring it all back home to heart center. Let's extend the palms out. Chins parallel to the mat. Feet are grounded. Preparing for sun salutation. Surya Namaskars. Standing tall in Tadasana. Mountain pose. Feeling rooted and strong like a mountain. Maybe you want to lift and drop your toes. If you close your eyes, you might even feel a bit of a sway side to side. And that's where we use our breath to ground ourselves. Let the breath zip up through the center line of your body. Breathe. Extend the palms out. Roll the shoulders open. 
Okay, both of your knees tucked in, buttocks tight. And slowly, hips start to flow together. Inhale, Uddhva Hatasana. Exhale, folding forward. Palms next to the feet, Uttanasana. Inhaling, flat back, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, release the palms down. Let's take the right foot back, swivel it back out as much as you can. Starting to stretch the legs out, knees down, toes extended out. Rising up, low lunge, reaching for the sky. Exhale, fold forward, frame the front foot. Take the left foot back, preparing for what we call a vinyasa. Exhaling down, inhaling, rising up, bhujangasana, cobra. Knees off the mat. Tops of the feet down and stretch up, high cobra. Exhale, Adho Mukha Svanasana, down dog. Lifting your butt. Maybe you want to pedal your feet out here, walking the dog. Or hold steady for a couple of breaths. As feels good. If you start to get tired at any point of time, just bring the feet down and rest it back out. Breathe and everyone, Knees back here, kicking back with the right foot, kick high, knee to chest, bring it forward, drop the opposite foot down, knee down, extend up, reach up, low lunge on the opposite side, exhaling, folding forward. We're going slow, remember to watch for the breath cues as you keep moving, prepare for cobra, anyone with back issues, we're feeling tired this morning, just let the back slide down and stretch up. Rise up. Exhaling, Adho Mukha Svanasana, down dog. Pedal your feet out. Kick back with the left foot, kick high. And knee to chest sliding forward. Drag the back foot in, fold forward, Uttanasana. Inhaling halfway. Exhale, release. Stretch up, Urdhva Hastasana. Exhale, hands to heart center, releasing back to Dasana. Let's take this once more. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhaling halfway. Exhale, release it down. Take the left foot back, stretch it out, rise up. This time, let's start to open the chest up, adding a bit of a back bend. Breathe, exhale, fold. Take the right knee back, look forward once again. Option to bring the chest down or slide with the back down as we all rise up for Cobra Bhujang Asana. Exhaling, Adho Mukha Svanasana, down dog. Breathe, kick back. With the left side this time, reach tall, bring it forward, release the back knee down. Inhale, rise up, open up, exhale, frame the front foot. And take the left knee back, releasing down, Bhujangasana, rise, exhale, down dog, Adho Mukhashwanasana, pause. Need a rest, tap your knees down. Don't drop the your foot like me. Kick back on the right side. Bring it forward. Bring the left foot in, fold forward. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, release. Stretch it up. And come back to heart center and pause. And let's start to move with our breath. Inhale, reaching up, Uttita Hattasana, palms together, exhale, fold forward, Uttanasana. Inhaling, halfway, flat back, exhale, release it down. Take the left foot back, extend it out, front knees over the ankle, rising up, low lunge. Let's start to open the chest up. If you're feeling worked up enough already, exhale, frame the front foot. Flowing through your vinyasa, take the right knee back. Exhaling, chest down. Inhaling, rise up, low cobra. And stretch it out, high cobra. Tuck in your toes, lift the butt up. Exhale, Adho Mukha Svanasana, down dog. 
Pedals are paid out. If it feels too much for your wrist already in the morning, just keep the knees down. And stay with me here. Moving, inhaling, exhaling. Remember to keep the breath within you. Take one movement and breathe. And let's take back with the right foot. Bring it forward. Bring the left foot in. Fold forward. Inhale halfway. Exhale. Release down. Reach up. Exhale. Hands to heart center. And let's take it to the other side. Inhale. Reaching up. Exhaling. Folding forward. Come up. Halfway. Exhale. Release. Let's take it to the right side now. Swivel it back. Stretch up. Open up. Exhale, freeze the front foot, take it back down. Once again, option to use the lower back to come down or chest down, butt up, sliding up. Smile, cobra, bhujangasana. Rise up as you exhale, breathe, kick back with the left foot high, bring it forward, drag the back foot in, fold forward. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, release, rise up, stretch up. Exhaling, hands to heart center, back to Tadasana. You can always pause the video if you need a quick break or to get a sip of water. Else, let's keep moving. Inhale, reach up, exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, release it back down. Take the right foot back this time. Maybe you want to start to keep the knee off the mat if you're feeling warmed up enough. Let's stretch up. Anjana Asana, Crescent Pose. Let's open up the fingers, the palms, up like a lotus, holding here. Stretching the back leg out, maybe you can root down, go a little deeper. Staying steady on the front leg, knees over the ankle. Breathe. Keep reaching up. Any point of time, if you need to take a break, just tap the back knee down. Otherwise, stay with me here. Three, two, one. Bring the lotus back to your heart center. Closing the palms. Frame the front foot. Kick back high. Sliding forward. We can start to add chaturangas. If you're using the knees, flow through cobra. Otherwise, come down halfway with me. Slide up. Open the chest up, exhaling, tuck in the toes, Adho Mukhashwanasana, down dog. Kick back with the left foot, bring it forward, drag the foot back in, inhale halfway, exhale, release it back, stretch up and exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, rise, Uttanasana, fold forward. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, release down. This time, let's take the left foot back, preparing for Anjana Asana on the other side. Steady yourself. Breathe. Stretch up. Look up. Maybe you want to open up in a lotus on the top once again. Hold here for three breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Strengthening the front leg, stretching the back foot out, extending the side body, reach, opening the heart up as you look up, exhale, frame the front foot, kick back high, slide forward, plank, halfway down, chaturanga, stretch up, Udva Mukhashwanasana, exhaling, Adho Mukhashwanasana as you tap in. This time, let's bend one knee, stretch the opposite leg out, hold. Inhale, exhale, switch. Once more, breathe. Remember, use your knees if you need a break to just come down or switch it with me to the opposite side. And Let's stretch it out fully. If you're down on the mat, start to lift up. 
breathe. And let's take it to our feet forward. Inhaling, coming up, halfway. Exhale, release. Stretch up, and hands come back to heart center. Pause, hold. Inhale, rise up. This time, let's try to keep the hands extended out as you release the back down, almost as if you're sitting in a chair. Utkatasana, chair pose. Hold and fold forward. Uttanasana. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, release the back down. Take the right foot back. This time, you're going to drop the foot out. As we rise up, strong warriors preparing to start our day. Veera Bhadra Asana 1. Hold. Once again, softening the warriors, opening the flower on top. Breathe. Holding steady. Root down a little stronger. Hips remain pointing forward. Holding here. 3, 2, 1. Turn the back foot in. Hands come down to heart center. Anjali Asana. And frame the front foot. Kick back. Slide forward. Flowing through your vinyasa. Coming down halfway. Or if you're using the knees. Coming down for cobra. Breathe. Inhale. Stretch up. Urdhva Mukha Svanasana. Or high cobra. Exhale. Adho Mukha Svanasana. Option here. To hold steady. Or to bend both knees. Lift the butt up. Stretch the legs back down. Breathe. Inhaling. Exhaling. Kick back with the left foot. Bring it forward. Drag the back foot in. Inhale halfway. Exhale. Release. Swoop up. Reaching for the sky. Exhale. Hands to heart center. Let's keep moving. Inhale. Reaching up. Come down, chair pose, Utkatasana. Exhale, empty the belly out, fold forward. Inhale, halfway, flat back. Exhale, release it down. Take it to the other side, left foot goes back. Turn it back out. Inhale, rising up, Veera Bhadrasana 1. Adjust yourself if you need to. Check that your front knee is over the ankle. Breathe, maybe drag the back foot in. Keep the belly engaged. Inhale. Stretch up. Open the palms out. Hold here. Breathe. Breathing from your feet. Letting the breath flow through the top of your body as you spread up. Bring the palms together. And exhale. Hands come to heart center. Turn the back foot in. Frame the front foot. Kick back. Slide forward. Come down halfway, stretch up and smile. Breathe, exhale, lift up, Padu Mukhashwarasana, down dog. Holding steady, bending, extending, do what feels right. Breathe, pause, and take it on your feet to the front of the mat. Inhale, come up. Exhale, release. Rise up and exhale. Come down to heart center. And let's spread out to the long edge of the mat. Continuing the full body flow. Start the morning. Breathe. Extend the arms out. Hold. Slowly hinge the hips back. Reach forward. Halfway. Preparing for wide legged forward bend. Maybe you can open out a little wider. Hold and release the palms down. Try to bring your head down towards the mat. Any injuries, always be mindful of what you can do. To stay wherever feels comfortable. Maybe you want to walk the fingertips back. Palms facing up. Hold. Letting the top part of your body relax as you feel the energy flowing through your legs. Keep lifting the kneecaps. And slowly walk the fingers, the palms over to one side. Inhale, spread the palms up, 
Let's take it over to the other side. Don't let the opposite knee collapse. Breathe. And inhale, let's bring the palms up to center. This time, let's keep the hands around our waist as we hinge forward. Pause halfway. Clasp your palms behind you and fold up. Hold. If it feels too much, just keep the hands on your lower back. Breathe. And gently release the palms out onto either side and slowly start to roll up. Feeling the breath within your calves, your hamstrings. Pausing once you're up to your butt, your waist. Letting it flow through your tight body and stretch up. Looking up at this beautiful flower on top, Lotus Padma Mudra, bring it back to heart center. And let's spread the palms out, bring the hands to our hips, starting to peel to our feet in. Not adding any jumps this early in the morning. And let's pedal our feet out. Breathe. Moving with the breath. Three. Two, one, and extend the palms out. Maybe we want to have some fun with this balance. Rise up on our tippy toes and slowly start to come down. If it feels too much or you start to hear some cracks, just go down gently. Use your hands to sit down. If you're with me, if you want to rise up with energy, reach up on your tippy toes. Balance, bring the hands to heart center and slowly start to sit down. Have some fun with it while we're all moving up and down. Last one, reach, reach, reach. Breathe and slowly, gently try to come down. Maybe you want to take a couple of seconds to pause and exhale. We're going to open the feet out, sitting in Malasana or Garden Pose. Maybe your heels are off the mat. You want to put some padding. If it doesn't feel comfortable, just take a pause and sit. If you're with me, Malasana or Garden Pose, use the elbows to press the knees out as the knees counter to come in. And release the hands to either side. Framing the feet, let's lift the right side up. Working a bit of shoulder opening, releasing the hand back behind you. Inhale, bring it back in. Exhale, release down. Over to the other side. Rotate it back and stretch it back up. Release it down. If you want to go deeper, reach for your fingertips behind and open the chest up. Pausing and slowly extending forward. Gently with control, coming down to sit, hands to heart center. Extend the left leg out, opening the right knee outwards. Keep the left toes pointed towards you. Reach up and release down. Good way to stretch the front leg and open the right hip. Breathe and rise. Bring the feet in, butterfly pose, titliyasana, just opening up as wide as you can, hold, another great pose to just close your eyes, feeling the breath all the way from your sacral area, from your roots, up through your core, through your heart, pausing in between your throat, in between your eyebrows, and exhale, let it go. Open your eyes, stretch the opposite leg out. Inhale, reach up. Exhaling, reaching forward. Breathe and lift. And exhale, release it out. And slowly stretch both legs out. And this time you want to flex and extend. Remember the feet that carry you through the day. Wriggle your toes, roll the ankles side to side, 
Breathe, adjust your body if you need to. As you come to sit up tall, Dandasana, Star Pose, reaching up and folding forward, Pashtimottasana. Breathe and gently walk your hands back, one breath at a time. Roll the shoulders, open the chest, smile and do the T-Rex once again. Exhaling, reaching forward, lengthen and then release down. If your hands don't reach all the way, just release the hands down on top of the shins or wherever you feel comfortable. If you want a deeper stretch, yes, extend the hands out all the way. Hold, let it go, release. Inhale, hands come back into center. Stretch up, exhale, release it out. Breathe and slowly come to sit in the center of the mat. Sitting in a comfortable cross-legged position, Sukhasana. Maybe bringing the thumbs and index fingers together to seal the back ends. Holding this freshness, this energy from this morning within us. And gently open your arms. Let's spread this energy out. As we meet back up, Lotus Mudra, Padma Mudra. Bend your finger and thumbs together. Gently look up, open your eyes. Slowly bring it back in to heart center. Bound your head. Chin gently release to the chest. And open your palms out. Starting your day with a beautiful, fresh smile this morning. I hope you can also share your stories, your journeys as we grow and flow together. And I look forward to seeing you soon again. Bye.